Hello, my name's Chris and I like talking about music, uh, specifically albums on Pitchfork. We're trying to review every single one every day. Here comes Lucas with his funny noise. Ah! <laughs> Not bad one, getting louder. Third and final album today, uh, 10th of July 2023, was Lauren Boosfield. Uh, an album called Salesforce, being in sales myself stood out uh, nothing to do not an ode to the crm as far as i could tell but who knows um no nothing about her sorry um 33 minutes so i know i wasn't into too much of a commitment which is always nice very noisy very noisy um very dramatic sort of music where you know everything's been thrown at it you know every every single thing every instrument that's in that studio was used to make some noise and there's nothing wrong with a bit of noise. Um, track two especially is a hell of a noise. Um, it's sort of hardcore metal, really, but not with too much guitar. You know, there are part of it that, that are proper. Oh, 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 oh. Um, sort of, but that track was sort of poppy in the end. That was definitely the track that stood out to me. Um, and we had a bit of drum and bass, still very noisy. It felt like a break, you know, even the hardest, one of the hardest um, drum and bass patterns I've ever heard sounded like it was a bit of a break from from what one and before it was it was hell of a racket but you know even a, a, but then again they've thrown a bit of classical in there um, mad classical obviously but um but yeah just sort of solo piano done in a very dramatic noisy kitchen sink way I guess all in all enjoyed it but not going to listen to it again because it was just too noisy and I had the kid in the background and I had to turn it down a bit um not the sort of thing you can play in front of the family you have to be a fan I think um uh, the second track stood out, sorry, I didn't write the name down. Um, I'm going to give it a 7.5. I think Pitchfork gave it a 6.8. Thanks.